The excavates are a major subgroup of unicellular eukaryotes, often known as excavator. The phylogenetic category excavator, proposed by Cavalier Smith in 2002, contains a variety of free-living and symbiotic forms, and also includes some important parasites of humans. Excavates were formerly considered to be included in the now obsolete Protista kingdom. Characteristics Many excavates lack classical mitochondria. These organisms are often referred to as amitochondriate, although most, perhaps all, retain a mitochondrial organelle in greatly modified form. Among those with mitochondria, the mitochondrial crista may be tubular, discoidal, or in some cases, lamina. Most excavates have two, four, or more flagella and many have a conspicuous ventral feeding groove with a characteristic ultrastructure, supported by microtubules. However, various groups that lack these traits may be considered excavates based on genetic evidence. The closest that the excavates come to multicellularity are the acrasia dye slime molds. Like other cellular slime molds, they live most of their life as single cells, but will sometimes assemble into a larger cluster. Subgroups Excavates are classified into six major subdivisions at the phylum class level. These are shown in the table below. An additional organism, Malawi monus, may also be included amongst excavates, though phylogenetic evidence is equivocal. Discoba or J.E.H. clade Euglenozoa and Heterolobosi appear to be particularly close relatives, and are united by the presence of discoid crista within the mitochondria. More recently a close relationship has been shown between Disacaristata and Jacobida, the latter having tubular crista like most other protists, and hence were united under the taxon named Discoba which was proposed for this apparently monophyletic group. Metamonads Metamonads are unusual in having lost classical mitochondria, instead they have hydrogenosomes, mitosomes or uncharacterized organelles. Monophyly excavate relationships are still uncertain. It is possible that they are not of monophyletic group. The monophyly of the excavates is far from clear, although it seems like there are several clades within the excavates which are monophyletic. Certain excavates are often considered among the most primitive eukaryotes, based partly on the placement in many evolutionary trees. This could encourage proposals that excavates are a paraphyletic grade that includes the ancestors of other living eukaryotes. However, the placement of certain excavates is early branches may be an analysis artifact caused by long branch attraction, as has been seen with some other groups, for example, Microsphoridia, Malawi monus in addition to the groups mentioned in the table above. The genus Malawi monus is generally considered to be a member of excavator owing to its typical excavate morphology and phylogenetic affinity to excavate groups in some molecular phylogenies. However, its position among excavates remains elusive. Malawi monus appears not to belong to excavator as it is close to Colodictian, which either appears close to amoebozoa or they form a basal unicone clay together.